My man's all make tracks like this. What's going on, y'all? Uh, I want to give a huge shout out to Candace Tuckle for doing the intro video uh, for me. It's been something I've been meaning to do for over a year. Uh, I'm going to leave her information in the description if anyone needs any graphic design work. Uh, in this video, though, I want to give you my first impressions of the Lawton Audio LA320. Uh, this is a microphone I picked up at GearFest this year, and I finally got a chance to use it in a uh, session a couple weeks ago uh, with a Nashville artist named NASDAQ. So the LA320 is a two microphone from Laden Audio. It is their new uh, series black is what they're calling it. Uh, they've kind of divided their products into two series, uh, signature series and the black series. I've been following Laden Audio for a while. I was really close to buying a Clarion uh, microphone and... Um, Instead, I decided to go with the uh, Mic Tech 67. Uh, but I've always wanted a tube microphone, so I was uh, really excited to get my hands on this one. Uh, so this is the box that it comes in that you see here. And once you get the box open, you've got a case here. I was kind of surprised that it came with a case because a lot of microphones in this price range, you don't get a case. However, with it being a tube mic and you need your, your power supply and your mic cable for it, kind of had to put it in a case. Uh, it's kind of, uh, I don't know, because this is the only tube mic I have. I don't know what other um, tube mics in this price range, how they're packaged, if they come with a case or not. I'm, I'm not sure, but uh, it is really nice to be able to get a case as well as a shock mount um, with this microphone, especially uh, for its price point. Uh, let's get into some of the features. You only have two switches on this mic. There is a a uh, high pass filter and a low pass filter. Um, really, uh, I'm going to say it's the first microphone I've seen a low pass uh, filter on. Um, and of course, the low pass filter rolls off the high end. And you know, depending on what you're recording, um, you know, sometimes you may want to do that. Uh, there's no uh, pad, and this is a cardioid only uh, microphone. So there's only one. Uh, pickup pattern on it. Not a problem. I mostly track vocals, which you want to track in cardioid most of the times anyway, so not a problem there. Uh, but let's get into uh, let's get into how this mic sounds. I'm going to get into uh, Studio One and play back some of the session I recorded with this mic. So uh, this vocal, uh, the vocal chain for this is Laudan Audio LA320 into a Presonus RC500, uh, maybe one to three dB of compression, no EQ, uh, into a UA Apollo. Uh, so again, this is an artist named NASDAQ uh, from Nashville. And so uh, let's check out a few bars here uh, recorded on the LA320. Yeah. From my mental through my digital to the drum, drum of your ear. ear. It's the truth word of God, like you say in a prayer. Yeah, one of the illest unbreakable Bruce, Bruce Willis. Willis. You missed the glass Sam Jack with a weak back. back. Niggas think they flow cold, I'ma heat that. Niggas think they flow sick, I'ma I'm treat that. that. One of the best with it without a check. I battle death just to rock a two pack in the flesh. Yes. Hit your belly in your chest like you're wearing a vest. Oh. All right, and uh, one more time. Yeah. From my mental through my digital to the drum of your ear. ear. It's the truth word of God, like you say in a prayer. Yeah, one of the illest unbreakable Bruce, Bruce Willis. Willis. You missed the glass Sam Jack with a weak yeah. back. Niggas think they flow cold, I'ma heat that. Niggas think they flow sick, I'ma treat that. that. One of the best with it without a check. I battle death just to rock a two pack in the flesh. Yes. Hit your belly in your chest like you're wearing a vest. Oh. Okay, so uh, just the raw vocal there. There's just a little bit in the low mids. I'm hearing uh, a frequency down there that I'm not liking, but. Overall, uh, I was really pleased with the detail. Uh, the RC500 is a clean pre. Uh, you know, as, as soon as the vocal came out of the monitors, I knew I was happy with it, and we would be, uh, you know, we'd be sticking with that chain and go ahead and using it uh, for this song. And, and just to show you what I did in the in the rough mix here, we just just had a little bit of a uh, little bit of EQ. I think I had a little bump let's see there we go and some and bring compression in so just this is what i did with it in the 
in the in the rough mix here. Uh, just a little bit of EQ. I didn't need a lot of EQ uh, when using that microphone, which is a sign of a good mic to me. Uh, you know, you shouldn't have to take a, uh, a vocal recording and EQ it to death. Uh, so just a little bit of the low mids I pulled out and a little bit of bump in the high mids. And uh, let's take a listen to it now. Yeah. From my mental through my digital to the drum of your ear. ear. It's the truth for the God, like you say in a prayer. prayer. Yeah, one of the illest unbreakable Bruce, Bruce Willis. Willis. You missed the glass Sam Jack with a weak back. back. Niggas think they flow cold, I'ma heat that. Niggas think they flow sick, I'ma, I'ma treat, treat that. that. One of the best with it without a check. I battle death just a rock or two, two pock in the flesh. Yes. Get your belly in your chest like you're wearing a vest. Oh. Okay, so we're going to uh, take a look next at the... LA 320 through a Neve uh, 511 pre, which was the uh, next pre that I tried with this microphone. So with this vocal chain, I've got the LA 320 into a Neve uh, 511, uh, no silk, uh, into a JDKV 12 compressor. It's for a uh, couple db of compression into the apollo with this vocal i used the low pass uh filter on the on the la320 so i want to see how much high end it would roll off and see how it would uh react with this vocal uh so here it is uh. I've been drinking since the clock started ticking. Easy, liver crying, I'm dying, still trying to drown sorrow, but sorrow will often follow. Loss and disappointment, music is mental ointment, and this bottle I swallow till the tank is good and hollow. All right, one more time. Uh. I've been drinking since the clock started ticking. Easy, liver crying, I'm dying, still trying to drown sorrow, but sorrow will often follow. Loss and disappointment, music is mental ointment, and this bottle I swallow till the tank is good and hollow. Okay, so with that low pass filter, I think it starts to roll off around 12k, but um, yeah, that just took off too much high end for me. You can tell the vocal sounds really dark because uh, it's missing that that high end. Um, also with the Neve, um, I was getting some low mids there I didn't like, and just to show you what I did in the rough mix on this one, uh, I boosted a lot of high end because with the uh, with that low pass filter on the mic, it rolled it off and. Again, cut a little bit of low mids. But, you know, this is also, I'm showing you this so you can see an example of how this mic uh, takes EQ. Uh, but here it is with the EQ that I made for the rough mix. I've been drinking since the clock started ticking. Easy, liver crying, I'm dying, still trying to drown sorrow, but sorrow will often follow. Loss and disappointment, music is mental ointment, and this bottle I swallow till the tank is good and hollow. It's good to be followed if you're certain of where you're going, check your GPS. Okay, so uh, there's two examples of the LA320 on hip-hop vocals. Uh, really impressed with this mic, again, especially for its price point, which I keep mentioning, but I haven't mentioned the price. It is $499, uh, so a buck under $500, uh, you can get a nice tube microphone from Laden Audio. So uh, one thing worth mentioning uh, that I forgot earlier is the high-pass filter is fixed at 120 hertz, uh, which may be kind of high, um, typically a mic's uh, high pass filter will be at 80 or 90. However, if you have other mic pre's, it's not a problem. Uh, look the same way with the with no pad being on on this microphone. It's not a problem because pretty much all mic pre's have a pad on them, and some mic pre's have a high pass filter on them, so you can adjust it there if the 120 hertz doesn't work for you. But you know this mic is you know I feel aimed at. Uh, project in home studios and like I say at four ninety nine is a really good price to get into two microphones because two microphones are uh generally expensive. Uh I've seen them uh from I guess I say typically around fifteen hundred, a thousand, fifteen hundred. You know, I've seen two microphones up there at six thousand. So you know, two microphones are generally not a cheap uh, microphone. Uh, there are a couple other mics in this price price range that are two microphones that I, I haven't heard. Uh, so it's not that this is the only two microphone in this price range, but you know, I really respect Laden Audio, so I was really excited when they you know came out with this product. So you know, if you're looking for a good two microphone, I recommend this one. Uh, once I use it on female vocals, I'll report back uh, on that. Uh, but you know, I think it's going to be a really good, uh, popular product for uh, Laden Audio. 
All right. Uh, you can uh, check more about this mic out on their website, which is lawtonaudio.com. And I'll catch you all next time.